the, the good thing about this uh, particular The fast charge capability of this ultimate machine is mind blowing. Right, after a lot of research of looking for a portable power station, I have finally went for this beauty here. Now, you know, there is few out in the market. You got Jackery, you got Blue AT, uh, there's, there's few out there. Now, I have finally decided to go for this EcoFlow River Pro portable power station. I'm going to show you the outer packaging. Got a nice handle, well packed. So it's got the model EF4 Pro. Um, it weighs out of the box 7.2 kilograms, which is 15.9 pounds. Now the capacity, this is called 720 watts hour. And um, it's got the AC output 600 watts can surge up to 1200 watts the, the good thing about this uh, particular uh, power station is the fast charging capability it will cost about 650 pounds in in uk so let's open this beauty and have a look inside That's all the, the charging cables and it's well packed on top of the box. You've got an app um, you can download. It's a free app and you can basically control um, the, the whole power station from the app. It is well packed. Yeah. Who wants that? <laughs> now here we go. Here we go. There we go. There you are. Oh, that's it. That's the box. Oh, it's quite portable. No, so size-wise, yeah, comparing to my hand, that's the size. Now I'm checking the build quality now here. Now it doesn't look cheap at all. Let's have a look in this box. Okay. This one, you can charge it off a car. It just goes in the cigarette light port. The charging cable is here to charge this off a solar panel. Yeah. That made me a shock because I was I was thinking, what? I'm in UK, and that's a DC charging cable. Now yeah, that's the UK one, US one. And the European. Yeah, that's the instructions um, how to connect to a solar panel. That's the user guide for the power station. Okay, well, that's all in that box. Now, let's have a look at this. Now, that's a torch. I'll show you that torch lighting um, in a minute. There's the on and off switch for the torch. There's a reset, Wi-Fi reset button um, here. Now that's a USB-C. Pretty impressive. It's, it can handle up to 100 watts. USB normal ports, and it's got a fast charge port as well. Now that's the main power on and off. That's a DC on and off. Got a car adapter, a socket. It's basically, that's all in the front. On the side here, two main AC output, the fan grill there. Now that is the AC on on off switch. Now this here, this is the expansion power port. You can basically buy a spare um, lithium iron from these people from the EcoFlow, and you can basically connect that, get a double amount of storage. On this side, you've got a door which opens. And that's the main supply goes in. Now this is a, it's like a trip switch. If you overload the power station, it will trip off. And then that's just, that's just a reset. And that's where the solar panel 
where the cable goes in. So let's turn it on. There you are. Right. It shows 30% charge because obviously they they cannot fully charge these sort of things while they do the courier. Then I'll show you this torch. That's first power. Second power. Bit more bright. Yeah, and a flashing light. There you are. Yeah, the light itself, if you are in the dark, is pretty impressive. Um, if you are camping out in a tent, that is plenty to light your tent. I'm going to take it in, give it a full charge. I'm going to check how long it's going to take it up to full charge. Now it's already 30%, and we need further 70%. We're going to check it out. took about three seconds and there's a fan started so the fan started blowing so basically this is sucking through there and it comes through there it's currently 32% charge in it so it's got the circle going that means this is charging so this here is how long will it take to be fully charged but it looks like well it says two hours no, oh yeah there you go so it takes says one hour now now the input so it's pulling 269 watts which is very good which is that is why it charges out so fast I don't know whether you can hear the noise of the fan but it's well, well there you are no it's not that bad it's not that bad at all but we're going to wait and see how long it will take after about five minutes um, the display goes off and it shows that the tiny light it flashes that means it's charging so there you are so that took about exact an hour to get to 99% from 30% of charge what the company says um, this can charge up to 80% in an hour time which is true I mean to get it fully charged you're looking about an hour and a half two hours fast charging capability of this particular power station that is the quality it shines on Right, here I have my old MacBook Pro. Yeah, they draw about 60 watts. You have to turn the AC switch here. Turn that on. Plug it in. Now, as you can see, it's drawing about, yeah, 49 watts. Um, you can supply around 16 hours of continuous power to that MacBook Pro which is really really good I'm going to plug in my 27 inch iMac there I'm going to turn the AC on so obviously the iMac is off so it's showing 3 watts so I'm going to power it up start a powerful computer like that it's going to draw a lot of like 100 watts eventually it's going to settle down to like 60 I think there you are. It shows 12 hours left. Now the next, I'm going to put my MacBook Pro. It's charging. So, iMac and the MacBook Pro is currently drawing 86 watts. I'm going to put three battery, um, one of the USBs there. So that's kicked off. That is charging. 
next I'm going to put my GoPro batteries so that's the GoPro batteries charging yep so I'm going to add uh, a multiple charger I'm going to use one for my iPhone there you are so that's charging now the another one I'm going to use it for my iPad Pro which is here another iPad yeah that's charging wow wow that is amazing it's drawing 103 watts it had about 94 percent all this will run for six hours the fast charge capability of this ultimate machine is mind-blowing now look at this all these can work from this portable uh, power station which is absolutely insane I'm going to use this beauty for next two months and then I'm going to uh, put out another review how I got on with it and hit the like button before you go and hit that subscribe button as well thank you so much See you next time. Bye-bye.